Number 65, when the 20 amp current through an inductor is turned off in 1.5 milliseconds, uh, a 800 volt EMF is induced opposing the change. What is the value of the self-inductance? So this one is very straightforward, right? We've seen the past 15 problems very similar. So the self-induced EMF is gonna be equal to the induction, or the inductance, excuse me, multiplied by the change in the current divided by the change in the time. If I have to solve this for inductance, I just can simply divide this whole term on out, right? So there's the formula now. So this says that the inductance will equal the EMF that is induced, and it says 800 volts was induced, divided then by the change in the current. Well, if it started at 20 and it was turned off, what's the change? Well, it would be then 20. Divided by the time over which it took to change that current, and they told us it's going to be turned off in 1.5 milliseconds, but you know by now that we need 1.5 times 10 to the minus 3 seconds, because we need it in seconds, not milliseconds. So just simply take out the calculator. It's going to be 800 divided then by parentheses, 20 divided by 1.5 times, that's an alpha, 1.5 times uh, 10 to the minus 3, sorry. And I got a question mark in there. One more time, 800 divided by parentheses, 20 divided by 1.5 times 10 to the minus 3. Close them. So six, uh, point six, point oh six, and well, I'll get it right eventually. So this is going to be 6.00, I guess, maybe three sig figs, but whatever, times 10 to the minus 2, and now that is in terms of Henry's, okay? Or about 60 milli Henry's, depending upon whatever unit you want to call it. All right, guys, thank you so very much for tuning in. Appreciate it. And uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next video. All right. And uh, yeah. <laughs>